What do you like most about going fishing? When, is when you cast your rod. You like to cast? Yeah. How about when the fish bites? Is, do you like that too? Oh yeah, you get that. Na, 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 yeah. You know, one of the reasons so many of us enjoy fishing so much is the people that we go fishing with. I've had the good fortune to share a boat with so many wonderful people over the years. People who fish are generally just really good folks. There's a double. No kid. In January of 2012, the fishing world lost two of the best. Two guys that were outstanding anglers, but more importantly, were outstanding people. Patrick Sheehan was a fishing guide in the Land O'Lakes area of Wisconsin. I got stuck working in a kitchen as a chef. <laughs> and I spent way too much time in the kitchen and not enough time fishing, so I kind of eased my way into the guiding end of things. I had the privilege to spend a good number of days in the water with Patrick chasing walleyes, but also chasing muskies and crappies. Jeff, this is a beautiful first muskie. That is awesome. Holy oh, cow. That is awesome. How about it? Nice spots and How all that stuff. How did it feel, bud? Well, aside from the leg shaking a bit. Patrick had a sincere affection for fishing in the outdoors. He was just a really good guy. And to me, there's nothing more important than that. Keep the rod up a little bit now. That's it. Oh, that's a big bass. Woohoo! Where's our net? Wait a minute. I got him. I got him for you. Oh, look at that one. The fishing professor, Jim McDonald, moved on to his next adventure January 27th this year. Mac was one of the pioneers in the fishing tackle industry. He was a longtime fishing guide in the Iowa Great Lakes region in the northwest corner of Iowa. Your feet hit the floor every morning, you get up and you're, you're ready to go. Mac was a true outdoorsman. If it had to do with the outdoors, Mac did it. Mac understood the importance of getting youth involved in fishing. He was instrumental in organizing dozens of youth fishing events over the years. And so and you gotta be a positive person uh, to get things going. The older you get, you know, you think, oh, guys should be nice to go back. Can't do it. I think you have to go forward. Mac and Patrick were wonderful ambassadors to the world of fishing and are missed.